Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel, Gemini Europe. So let's see what we got for you for the weekend. God, universe, angels, spirit guides, and ancestors, please give me some clear, concise messages. Give us some clear, concise messages for the sign of Gemini. What messages do we have for the sign? Oh, Gemini. Five of Pentacles on the bottom. Leaving something out of code or financial lack. Somebody's getting justice for some type of financial lack. Uh, going into calmer waters and finances, possibly getting a new job here. Or this is somebody uh, getting justice for being left out in the cold and is now going into calmer waters. We have the two of materials here. Somebody is weighing the options here. We got five of inspiration. The nine of voices. The empress. The magician. The eight of inspiration. Temperance, five of voices. So somebody's juggling, not juggling, weighing the option of whether to manifest something or not. I feel like ego could be a bit of a problem here, but there's some type of communication somebody wants to send out when it about balancing, but there's a lot of anxiety here. There could be an empress at play that somebody could have possibly deceived. Tell me about the five of voices. Tell me about the five of voices. Five of emotions. The inspiration. Okay. So somebody's conflicted. Gemini energy. Somebody's conflicted about reconciling with somebody in a relationship and healing something. This person does make them happy, but they're concerned about the, if this is going to be a good decision or not for the long term. Tell me about the empress. But if this person is an empress, they're definitely worth the investment. Ten of emotions. The Muse of Inspiration, the Queen of Inspiration. So this is the King and the Queen of Wands, which is my Divine Masculine, Divine Feminine card with the Ten of Cups. So this is the Empress, definitely the Empress, and you, somebody else is the Emperor here. They definitely worth the uh, investment. Somebody's confused. Their, their, their ego must be in the way. Tell me about the Five of Inspiration, or maybe they think it's other people involved. I'm hearing Michael Jackson. I'm staring at the man in the mirror. I'm asking him to change his ways. Somebody's walking away from being so egotistical. They're putting an end to it. Look at the Ten of Swords. Somebody's putting an end to whatever this Five of Wands is. The drama, the confusion, the commotion. And they're taking a stand here with this Leo card. And you could be dealing with a Leo, but they're presenting something new here. But they're weighing options. Tell me about this two of materials. On what to manifest or how to manifest. Yeah, excuse me. There's some type of awakening that's taking place. Somebody's already made a decision to manifest a new beginning. They're just uh, weighing how to get it done. Tell me about this magician. They're, they're, they're contemplating on what to say. Manifest a second chance in a collaboration and have a victory this time. Tell me about the nine of swords, nine of voices, but this is it's some stress and anxiety. The emperor, there's the emperor coming out right next to the empress, the queen of materials and the knight of materials. There's some heartbreak. Somebody's healing from heartbreak here. 
possibly um, a wife or a mother or a baby mama or somebody if the emperor is he's healed is maybe he's healed from the heartbreak and he's 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 nervous about investing and nurturing the situation he's thought about it long and hard but he's still nervous he's still some way shape or form conflicted that this could be a bad decision but it's really not because this is the empress so yeah that's what i got for you oh well damn five minutes let's see so let's see about the communication then tell me about the eight of inspirations definitely an emperor and empress situation going on here definitely a lover's connection okay what's that yeah somebody's ego's in their way a little bit they're concerned because the tower is here they're concerned about the communication they want to heal and they want to have equal give and take but the tower tell me about the tower oh then the devil's on the bottom they're afraid tell me about the dow the tower the tower i'm trying to say the devil and the tower at the same time yeah they're concerned that <clears throat> could be dealing with a queen of cups Scorpio, Cancer, Pisces, they're concerned if they're charging here passionately and speak about their feelings and this equal give and take that somebody might decide that they don't want to be with them. They're concerned that it might be too late. <clears throat> Somebody's concerned that it might be too late to express how they feel. Tell me about temperance. They want to find the balance, but they just don't know how. Uh, I say just do it. Yeah, somebody's had time to think about and reflect on the energy that they brought into the connection in the past, which was toxic, and they want to start fresh. But I do feel like they're a little afraid that you might end it when they propose a commitment to you. Or maybe they had to end a commitment first. But either way, this person is afraid that you might turn them down. Or you're afraid that they might turn you down either way. But that's what I got for you, Gemini, and I do hope it helps. But the chariot on the bottom says that you guys are going to move forward to calmer waters here. It's just unknown. Somebody needs to take the leap. That's what it's all about, following the intuition and the love in their heart to this brand new beginning. So that's what I got for you. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share. Peace.